Hello, I'd like a cup of tea, but you know, I haven't got a kettle. I do have an air pump though, so I'm gonna boil some water at 20 degrees Celsius. Got a bit of water. Let's put it under here. It's closed off properly. Let's turn on the air pump. So the water is boiling, now I can't get this off because it's a vacuum in there, so let's put in some air. Now I can take it off, nice, careful. Hmm, forest fruit. Two to three minutes. Let's speed up the video a little bit. That should do it. Okay, let's take out the tea bag, put it here, and we've got ourselves a nice cup of tea. Yuck! It's disgusting! It's cold! It's just still 20 degrees Celsius! It was boiling though, at 20 degrees Celsius, but at a lower air pressure. This diagram shows you the phases of water. On the horizontal axis you can see the temperature, and on the vertical axis the pressure. In this region water is a liquid. In this region water is a vapor, or a gas. And in this region water is ice, a solid. This line indicates standard air pressure at sea level, one bar. This line indicates zero degrees Celsius, and this line indicates 100 degrees Celsius. At the intersections of these points, ice freezes at the left, or it starts to boil at the right. Now as pressure drops, you can see that the freezing point doesn't change that much, but the boiling point moves left, which means water will start to boil at a lower and lower temperature as pressure drops. Hmm. I don't like forest fruit anyway, so better to go and find an air and a kettle, a proper kettle, instead of an air pump.